And we begin tonight at City Hall, where we find our Mark McAllister. Mark, a few COVID-19 cases in Toronto are raising some eyebrows tonight. Some serious questions surrounding the new locations for the emergency child care center set up for essential workers tonight. One of the seven locations that had been set up for those essentials, essential workers children now have cases of COVID-19. Four staff members and one child eight months old. The Jesse Ketchum Center opened on March 31st and has now been shut down for two weeks. 58 children and staff are now being asked to stay home while the facility undergoes a deep cleaning and an investigation takes place. Another child has tested negative and test results are pending for one other staff members. Six other city run locations remain open with what officials say are strict health care procedures in place. The, these cases were discovered when a couple of the staff members were tested after getting sick. I am totally satisfied that the most stringent of standards were put in place from the beginning of the opening of these uh, child care centers that we put in place to help our uh, uh, essential service workers to do their jobs. And I now uh, am totally confident that our staff and uh, public health officials and everybody else will be looking for anything else we might do uh, in order to make sure this doesn't happen again. Many of them are health care workers and understand that the kinds of things that are being put into place, the protections that are being put into place at the child care centres are actually quite similar to that which they see within their health care facilities. Uh, and those protections, those measures that are being put into place are based on the best available science that we have in regards to this virus uh, at this time. 